What's going on everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some more Subnautica. So in this episode, last episode, we got the prawn suit, which is cool, which is fantastic. But this episode, we're gonna be doing something. We're gonna be kind of pulling away from that just for a little bit. Just pulling away just a little bit. What we're gonna do, we're gonna do some base building. We're gonna do some base building. There's some things, there's some components, you know, things like that that we don't have. And uh, I just kind of want to make this space a little more, a uh, little more homey. So uh, yeah, if you guys enjoy, don't forget to leave a like if you haven't already. Don't forget to subscribe as well. So I did go out and grab a bunch of titanium. I got a well, I say I got a bunch, but in actuality, once we start building everything, we'll see how much it actually is. And uh, yeah, I just want to get like a bedroom area, you know, like the desks, things like that. We're probably gonna need some quartz at some point as well. But uh, yeah, I figure we just make our base, you know, like nice and homey. Um, I think we're probably gonna. Oh my gosh, I got a lot more titanium than I thought I did. Holy moly! How much did I get? Oh my gosh! <laughs> Holy! Oh, that's a lot. Um, that's gonna completely fill this guy up. Holy moly! Okay, I guess I got a lot more than I thought I did. <laughs> And I even got, I have some in my storage in here too. <gasps> oh jeez. Uh, there's another four. Oh my gosh. Okay. So we're gonna have all kinds of tons of stuff, and uh, yeah, it's gonna be a good time. It's gonna be a good time. So I'm thinking like uh, we might throw another moon pool in here as well. I don't know. We're gonna have to see what we need for that. Honestly, before we before we tackle that and say we're gonna do that. So um, there's three and four. Okay, we're good. We're good. So let's go ahead and grab that much. Okay. Now I was thinking, uh, actually we're gonna need this guy. Nope, that's not what I want. Nope, oh, wrong. Okay, back to base, let's do it. Now I do wanna put something going up so we have an area above the water. I think that'd be kinda cool, you know, like let us, uh, let us look out and see some things and I was actually kind of thinking about putting that right here because we have our alien containment in here, and we could have a we could have a two-story one if we really wanted to. Um, I think vertical connector. You know, maybe not. What if we did? What if we did a main multi-purpose room right? No, nope, right there. Okay, let's do that. Hopefully, it doesn't get damaged from this thing. I don't think it will. I don't think it will. Um, and then let's go ahead and throw a vertical connector on top of it. Why won't you? What? I don't understand. What's 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 going on here? Oh. Oh, vertical connectors go in hallways, don't they? They do. We could always do another multi-purpose room. Should we do another one? Let's do another one. Let's double it up. Let's double her up. We'll do this. Okay, and now um, I kind of want to throw. Hmm. I would. I would kind of like want to throw one right here-ish. Oh, we can't throw it on these because we don't have. We don't have extenders off of these yet. Huh. Because we don't have any any kind of extenders or anything, so we can't even turn these to glass at any point. Oh dear. How are we going to do this? I'm just trying to think like the focal point of our area. Let's do this. Let's go ahead and I don't have any glass. I'm actually not even worried about it. I'm not really really worried about that right now. Let's throw this guy on here. And let's throw a vertical connector on this like that. How high does that take it up? Not high enough. We'll do another one. Are we really gonna have to do an, an additional one? We are. <laughs> it's gonna be sticking out of the water a little bit. That's fine, okay, vertical connector. And then, and then, let's throw a, can we throw an X apartment on here? Let's do that. Okay, oh, it's nighttime, yeesh. Eesh, this is why we need a bedroom. We definitely need a bedroom. We could throw a bedroom in up there. We could sleep above the water. That could be kind of cool. Uh, oh, we're gonna throw a ladder in here. Where is 
Ladder. I don't want it there. Right there will work. That'll be a good spot for it. Boop. Good to go. And we can climb up. Perfect. And climb down. Okay. Ooh, I'm gonna need another ladder. You know, it's a good thing that I had all this titanium. <laughs> uh, climb up. Okay, so perfect, 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 perfect. Okay. I like it. I'm thinking we're gonna throw an observatory. Actually, I think we're gonna put our bedroom up here. Why not, right? Absolutely, we're underwater enough. We might as well, well, an underwater bedroom is kind of cool if we threw windows and stuff around it. Actually, this would be a good spot for a bedroom. Huh, that would be a good spot. We might actually do that. Okay, let's see. I probably need some more titanium. I do. I do. So let's start with, let's start with a bed so we can sleep through the night. Uh, interior modules, this right here. A double, wait, what am I missing? Fiber mesh, Oh. Okay, well what about a desk? Where's the desk at? Here's the desk. And then the swivel chair, uh, office chair, command chair. We're gonna need a command chair. We're gonna need that. We're gonna need a coffee machine, absolutely, okay. We need fiber mesh. You know, I made fiber mesh at one point. Fiber mesh is creep vine sample. I don't think, I'm pretty sure I converted it into, I converted it into something. I don't remember what exact, wait, oh, that's synthetic. Oh, fiber mesh, look at that! Ha <laughs> ha, it's a win. It's a win, it's a win, it's a win. Okay, so let's do, um, I'm thinking right here-ish. We'll do that, okay, perfect. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's a beautiful bed. What a beautiful bed it is. Okay. Now, we need a desk. Absolutely need a desk. Um, it's hard getting this centered. That's pretty darn close. We'll go with that. And then we need a command chair. Let's go ahead and see if we can't put it like right here. There. Can I sit in it? Sit. No, it won't let me sit in it, darn it. <laughs> we, we built it too close to the desk. Okay, that's fine. Um, would a swivel chair actually like work? Uh, I'm actually kind of curious now. Okay, so if we put that there, that's switched, sit. Not enough space to sit, okay. All right, that's not gonna work either. Take that out. We'll go back to the command chair and we'll just have to put it out further. How about like right there? Can I sit in there? Oh, <gasps> yeah, look at that. And then we're just like boop, 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 working. Okay, I like it. I like it. All right, so there's that. There's that. Let's see what else we can do in here. We got to make it a little homier. Um, I think we should throw a counter in here. Yeah, we'll throw a counter right there. And then... A vending machine? We'll throw a coffee machine, maybe? Right there. Okay. You look like you could use some coffee. <laughs> I love the voice. The voice is the greatest. And then... We're gonna need a vending machine for sure, so we can get our snacks going. So we can get our snacks going. Uh, did it need glass? Oh, it actually needs glass. It's kind of expensive. Uh, luckily, I have enough quartz for one glass. Yeesh. Did I get my coffee? I did get my coffee. Consume. <gasps> delicious. Absolutely delicious. Oh, this is a full size thing. Ew. I kind of wanted it next to this. Huh. I kind of wanted like a whole little snack area. Okay, you know what? We'll deconstruct this. We'll deconstruct this. Uh, uh Okay, vending machine. Let's throw the vending machine right here. Okay, there's a vending machine. Now, do I want a counter? I kind of want a bar. I, I kind of want a bar table. 
so we could sit at the bar table and eat our snacks. Um, we could always throw one of these. No, I don't want it there. We could always throw this right here. Okay, we'll do that. And then we'll throw our coffee vending machine. Uh, right there. We'll do that. Okay, perfect. Uh, use. Oh, look at that. How delicious. What kind of snacks do we got? We got a potato mix. A potato mix. Fantastic. Okay, and then we could always throw a table. Oh, it's getting cramped already, though. It's getting a little cramped. You know what? Actually, what we really could do. This might work. Let's deconstruct the double bed. And let's throw the double bed. We're going to put it actually right here, I think. We'll do that. And then we can throw a table and a chair right here for some snacks. And yeah. All right. Things are looking good. I'm liking our base so far. Hmm. One of these. I kind of want windows, though, to be honest. I really kind of want windows. That's not going to work there. We could always throw it in and then put the bed in front of it. See, I want, I want windows. I want a lot of windows, honestly. Hmm. Pretty sure you can't do hallways. You can't. What if we do, uh... No, I don't want that. I don't want no foliage in here. You know, allergies, things like that. It's just not gonna work. It's just not gonna work. Uh, oh, trash can. We're gonna need a trash can. Let's throw it right over. Well, let's keep it next to the vending machine, shall we? We'll throw it right here. Who knew interior design would be part of Subnautica, right? Throw that there. Beautiful. Look at that. Beautiful. Who empties this, though? I'm pretty sure I made that comment before. It looks like it's already full. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. All right. Is it daytime out? It is not. Let's actually... Oh, you know what? Hold on. Let's see. Interior modules. There's a bulkhead, isn't there? Interior modules. Wait. Wait. Bulkhead. Should we put a bulkhead? Absolutely. We need a door. You gotta have that privacy when you're living by yourself. Doesn't matter. You know what, though? Honestly, think about it. If you were living by yourself, wouldn't you want... <gasps> I can't put a bulkhead here because this isn't an extension. I bet you anything that's what it is. Bulkhead. Oh, no! It's because it's not an extended... It's not extended out. Oh! This is awful. <laughs> I want a bulkhead right here. It looks like there's. It looks like it should go right here. It really does. Okay. Well, that's not gonna work. Anyways, what I'm saying is, if you're stuck on a plan all by yourself and you're going to bed, don't you think you'd probably lock your door? That way, you only had your one room to worry about. I'm just saying. Even if you're the only person there, you just just in case, because like, if someone was gonna get in and get you while you're sleeping, oh, that'd be scary. That'd be the worst. All right. Run a little titanium. That's fine. What do we need? for an observatory. Enameled glass, we need enameled glass for that. In a moon pool, we need two titanium ingots and some lubricant, that's not awful. Scanner room, That could, we could play with that a little bit. We need a lot of glass, we need glass and titanium, like a bunch more glass, bunch more titanium. Uh, I don't really know what we're doing in here yet. I don't really know, this might be our storeroom. We might store stuff in there. And then in here, those are exterior. Water filtration machine might be uh, might be kind of important. Importante for sure. We also need some power cell chargers and a uh, battery charger. We don't have a battery charger yet. Ugh, that's gross. We're gonna need titanium quartz for that. One of these would be nice, but I'm not really worried about it because since we're so close to the. Uh, our little crash pod anyways. How's this doing for powering stuff? Fantastic, absolutely wonderful, okay. So let's do, let's go get some, I'm gonna go try to find some glass, I'm gonna try to find some more titanium. Um, I'm gonna leave all this here because I don't need any of this right now. Um, we'll go ahead and do that and these are both 100%, how are this? Oh, that thing's almost dead, but we can deal with that when we get back. Scanner. 
Okay, we'll take one. We'll take one battery with us just be just in case. And we'll eat some melons too before we go. Alrighty, so after a night of collecting, um, I did get a whole bunch more uh, titanium. I got, as you can see, I got a bunch of stalker teeth and a little bit of quartz. I didn't get a lot of quartz. I actually didn't, I didn't get that much. But uh, we want to make our observatory. So we need two enamel glass and one titanium. So let's go ahead and grab one. There's that one. We're going to need two of those. And I actually had to build a whole other storage locker just so I can hold all this stuff. Oh my goodness, that's kind of funny. Uh, okay. Now, enamel glass is going to be okay. Good, 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 good. I can't ever remember if like the enamel glass is glass then the Starker Tooth or if it's the quartz plus the Starker Teeth. So I always have to verify. And there's that. Perfect. Okay, so I guess we're going to have to go outside to do this. You know what? I think we can actually do it from the inside. Can we do this from the inside? Let's check it out. Let's see if we can. So we'll pop up in here. And I think we're going to try to do this. Oh, yeah. It looks like it's going to work. Okay, perfect. So there's that. <gasps> oh, look at that. Look at that view. Specific research task in mind. Observatories and other glass modules are imprudent. Survival Thank you. I like it because it's cool looking. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay. Now, okay, we could do windows. I'm going to need to get more lithium though because our our base eesh, our our base structural health is going to be is going to be rough. It is going to be rough. So let's see. What else do we have? Hmm. What should we do here? We could just put a chair here just to actually, you know what, would kind of be cool, maybe? How big is that? Hmm. This is going to be for meditative purposes. Meditative purposes. So we'll put that there. And then sit. <gasps> oh. Look at that. You can come up here, sit up here with your coffee, enjoy the beautiful morning. That's what I'm doing. That's exactly what I'm doing. I'm sitting and meditating. Ah, oh, it's so nice. All right, enough of that. We gotta get back to work. Get back to work. Okay, so we built that. <laughs> it's kind of a, uh, I don't know. It's kind of, I guess it's kind of pointless. Anyways. Now, we're going to also need another moon pool, so should we do that? I do have the stuff for titanium ingot. Uh, I believe I have two lead, and we do have lubricant. Let's actually go ahead and just get that guy built as well. While I have the materials to do so, titanium ingot, what is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, so 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. That should give us two titanium ingots, perfect. I like it. It takes 10 per ingot, huh? It's weird because it looks like it comes in a stack of three. I feel like I'm being lied to a little bit. Just a little bit. Okay, so there's that. And yeah, we'll figure it out. I'm not worried. And moon pool, lubricant, and lead. I don't think I have any lubricant. There's two lead. That was two lead, right? Yep. I don't believe I have. Oh my gosh, it was perfect. It was just meant to be. That's not what I want. I want this. We're going to grab a couple more of those. And we are going to go ahead and throw another moon pool in here. Whee! <laughs> um, I guess we're going to go this way. Yeah, we're going to go like right here. Hopefully it connects. Are you going to connect up? I think it will. Oh, is negative 4.25. Okay, hold on. Deconstruct. Okay, we'll just leave it like that. <laughs> We're gonna have to fix it. Uh, is everything filled up with water? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Okay, so let's go ahead. Oh my gosh. Is that it? This is the problem with having a big base. And not having it reinforced. We definitely need to get some reinforcements in here. Just because I don't <laughs> I don't think there's anything else anywhere. 
Okay. All right. Do I have any lithium though? I don't. Oh, I have one. I have two. Do I have any more? Lithium is one of those things that it's kind of hard to find sometimes. Um, do, 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 do. I'm not seeing any any more lithium. Nope. Okay. So let's go ahead. Let's see. This is the central room in here. Let's see if we can't get. What is this going to bring us up to? How much does that add? It adds seven. I like it. Uh oh. Oh, I'm, I, did I run out of titanium? No way. He didn't run out of titanium. That's impossible. Okay, there we go. And my power is about to die on this thing now, too. It says exchange power source. There, look at that. We did it. Oh my goodness, we did it. It's fantastic. Okay, so let's go ahead and get that moon pool back in here. <gasps> we <laughs> Finish this guy up. Shoink. And perfect. Okay, so... Oh, look at that. It's like a double hallway. Neato. Very neat. Okay, so let's go ahead and bring our let's bring our stuffs in here, shall we? Let's see, we got a prawn suit right here. I like it. Now we Oh, thank you. Thank you, Prawn. You're so nice. Um, I think we're actually gonna put the prawn suit in this one over here because of how I will get it, don't worry. Just because of how close the ground is, and this thing actually sits on the ground versus the sea moth is not supposed to be on the ground, so if it drops out and hits the ground, that's not a good thing. Not a good thing for anybody. Wait, it's over here. Z moth. Z moth. <laughs> okay. There. Oh, we're gonna have a little spot for both of our vehicles. Oh, it's so amazing, fantastical. <gasps> Look at that. Zemoth docked, charging 76%. And, oh, does this charge while it's in here? It says it's 100% charged. Oh man, I kinda wanna make the vehicle modification station just so we can have uh, something say, you know, something else docked. Oh man. We're probably gonna have to do that at some point. At some point, okay, so we got that, perfect, those two. Now, what else do we, well, what we actually really need is we need some battery chargers. We need some battery chargers, uh, but we don't have any. We have power cell chargers, advanced wiring kit, ruby times two, I don't, we're not going to make that. Not going to happen right now. <laughs> not even close. Uh, base modules, scanner room, copper, gold, and table coral sample. Let's do that. Let's throw a scanner rune on here. A scanner rune. A scanner room. What did we need for it? Copper, gold, and table coral. Okay. So we need water. Let's go ahead and just drink this. Boom. Good to go. Okay. Copper, gold. Copper. Do I have any gold? Gold. Table coral. Was there one in here? I feel like there. That's a coral tube. We need a table coral sample. I don't think I have any. Okay, let's sleep. Let's get it to be daytime. We'll be back. Yeah, beautiful morning time. Oh, oh, you know what? Hold on. It's morning. We need a cup of Joe. And we need a snack. I like how these two like just cancel each other out. Give me that cup of Joe. Uh, you're missing the cup there. You're, you're making a mess. That's why I have this counter here, just so we can whip it, whip it, whip it, in case we need to. Thank you. Ah, oh, beautiful. Okay. So we need a table coral sample. Table coral, table coral, table coral. Where are you, table coral? There's some right here. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Could not ask for a better position. Take you. And you. We'll take one of these. We'll take this one, too. Why not? Okay, perfect. Now, let's build our scanner room. Actually, we already have everything we need. Perfect. Okay, so, scanner room. We could very well throw it up here. Actually, let's do that. I feel like it'll look kind of cool. We also need to put more hatches in. <laughs> oh, having this one way in is, is not the most ideal thing in the world. What happens if you put a hatch above the surface? I don't know. Uh... Wait, what happened? Huh. 
Huh. That doesn't like to work like that. Alright. I guess we have to build it from outside? That's weird. The observatory worked good, but that, not so much. You know what? Is it because it's... Oh! Hello! It did start building it. Oh. Neato. And... It's not connected to anything. It's, it didn't connect to anything. <laughs> Why? Why did you not connect anything? Oh, we had to rotate it. Oh, okay. We had to rotate it because there's a front and a back. Is this going to work above... Uh... This isn't going to work above water. We're going to try it. Because those camera, <laughs> those cameras aren't in the water, so how are we gonna get them in? Oh my gosh, okay, this is actually gonna be kinda funny. Let's check it out. <laughs> we need a hatch right there for sure. Um, okay, so there's that. Can check camera. Oh! <laughs> um. We, we're not gonna be able to, oh, uh, we're not gonna be able to put it back on the charging station. Okay. All right, that's fine. We're gonna, we're gonna have to, it has to go in the water, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry it has to go in the water, because that's just not gonna work like that. Oh, it looks kind of cool, though, when it's, like, up out of the surface like that. Oh, well. All right, let's take you back out, and we'll put you somewhere, somewhere underwater. So here's a fun little tidbit. Here's a camera drone. Um... That is 100% charged. Assign quick slot. What? Yeah, now what do I do? <laughs> uh, okay. I, I don't. I don't see the purpose of that. Whatever. Anyways, let's go ahead and just throw this guy over here. So, is that gonna give me a free camera drone? Is that? Do we? Do we beat the system here? I think we may have beat the system. We may have beat the system, guys. Because we're going to get another two drones, but you can only have two per. But you can build them. So there's one drone. There's the other one. Yeah, they're both here. They're both on here. Oh, we need another hatch so bad. Do I have the stuff to make a hatch? I don't think so. What does a hatch take? Hatch is quartz. I think I have, I think I have a little bit more quartz in here. We need more hatches. We can't get in anywhere. Um, there's quartz somewhere. I could swear there's more quartz somewhere. Boom, one more. Is that all we have? Do we have some in here? Oh, perfect. Okay, we'll throw two hatches on. Figure out where we want these hatches at. So we have this one. So if we're on this side of the base, that'll work. Um, I think we'll throw one in here. Yeah, we'll throw one right here. That'll give us access to this side. And then, I think we'll throw another one in. Can we throw one right here? Perfect, I like that. Right there, perfect, okay. Boop, hop right in. Good to go, okay. So, okay, so there's camera one. Camera three, camera two. It did give us a free one. So where's camera two, camera three, camera two, camera three. Oh, it's not giving me a camera one. Oh, okay. So now if I throw said camera out, blink. I think we got a free camera drone off this guys. <laughs> I think so. Um, Cause I think you can go in here. <gasps> Oh, we can totally steal cameras now. Camera two, camera one. Ha! Look at that, we got free cameras. Uh, I wonder what the range is on these things. Cause I mean, we could just leave this chilling, like watching something. Oh, that could be cool. We could totally duplicate these and just have them like all over the place. I don't know what the purpose of that would be. But it could be fun, nonetheless. Actually, let's just do this. Let's have it overlooking our base. In case we see anything crazy going on, we'll be able to see. 
Perfect. Ha, <laughs> that's so funny. Oh, we totally cheated the system. Okay, so... Scanner room HUD chip, camera drone, scanner room range upgrade, and scanner room scanning speed. So now we can actually request a data box. Is there any data boxes with? Oh, this is a pretty big range, I've got to say. Scanning. I wonder how, I wonder, oh, there's one. We found one right here. Right there, we found one. Interesting. Stop scanning. So yeah, that was, there was one right there. Like, how is it little drones? Also, stalkers do like to take these guys. Oh, this is super cool. Um, okay, what did it take to scan room range upgrade? Magnetite and copper, let's do it. We have some magnetite from the last episode, so. We can handle it. We can handle it. Uh, we'll go this way, and then this way, and then this way. Oh my gosh, we're gonna need signs. Oh my gosh, okay, so... One, two, three. I wanna see how far we get the range on this bad boy. And one, two, three. That's all of our copper. Oh well, don't care. Uh, I guess we should probably eat something, huh? Vital signs, stabilizing. Vital signs are stabilizing, that's good. Look at that, now we're completely full. Um, we need our knife back, though. And we gotta replant these. Alright, we're good. Scanner room upgrade coming up. We're gonna see if this stacks. I think it will. I think it will. Actually, what was the HUD? Scanner room speed, don't care. Um... Computer chip and a magnetite? Maybe we should, uh, maybe we should make this and two of these. Let's make two of these. Actually, maybe we should make the, uh... The HUD first. Okay, what's that range go up to? Did it increase the range at all? I don't feel like it did. Okay, so we need a computer chip and magnetite. Let's actually get that built up before anything, because that actually will probably be handy. Uh, computer chip is what? What is computer chip? Gold and copper wire. Ooh! I don't think I have any more gold. I do have gold. Copper wire is gonna take... Okay, so we'll have that. I think we'll be good. Copper wire. What was the other thing? What was the other stuff? I don't even remember. Oh, nothing. We're good. Okay. Computer chip. Now, we have one copper. Okay, so we have enough for one more range upgrade. And the HUD. I like it. I do like it. This thing's kind of in the way. Um, we don't even have anything any- Oh wait, we have one Reginald in there. One lonely Reginald. Alright, so let's do the HUD. And a range upgrade. Perfect. Go ahead and throw that one in there. Wait. Where did my HUD go? Wait. Oh, do you not put it in? Scanner room HUD chip. Oh, it automatically, oh! Very neat. Oh, we should need to do the ultra high capacity. Oh yeah, okay, it's It's definitely expanding out now. Uh, I would, I would say so. So let's see, let's do the data box again. Okay, so. Oh! Should we go try to get it? Let's go try to grab that. I'm, I'm curious. Uh, Seamoth! Let's do it, you and- Oh, there's one over there too? Ooh! Oh, this is gonna be handy! How far away are you? It doesn't say how far away it is. Maybe it does, I just didn't see it. Oh, it's behind... Oh, okay, so we haven't gotten into this wreck yet. Okay, let's see, what's, how do I, how does one... Can one get in here, or do we have to cut this door? What are you doing? God, you guys are annoying. You guys are so obnoxious. I hate you so much. <laughs> Alright, let's see. 
Uh, we're gonna have to cut this open, huh? No, there's no cutting option here. How does one get in here? It'd help if I had my light. How do how do you get in this one? Oh wait, right here. Oh yeah, <gasps> yeah. Wait, battery charger, battery charger, battery charger. Wait, there. Thank you. Battery charger fragment. Yes. Ha <laughs> ha. Win. So there's one. Here's two. Oh boy. And we got a data box. Oh my gosh, this is like literally right next to me the whole time. Uh, that gets to give me titanium. Darn it. <laughs> uh, battery charger fragment. Don't think we're gonna need it. We'll take the titanium and propulsion cannon fragment. Pretty sure we already have that. We do. Alright, what do we got on this other side? What do we have in here? Modification station fragment. We already have a modification station, but we'll take the titanium. Modification station fragment. We'll take the titanium anyways. E anything else good? Doesn't look like it. Alright. Let's get out of here. Let's go grab the other data box. So I'm actually kind of curious like what's going to be in these now because we already got that one. So that one's good to go. Uh, oh, this way. And then this way and then this way. Okay. Let's go see where the other one's at. All right. We got wreck number two. I guess we haven't been to this one either. Let's see. Okay. That door's going to have to be cut open, which is fine because we have our handy dandy laser cutter. All right. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Let's see what's in this one. Hopefully it's something new. I don't know what it would be, honestly, though. As close as it is to the base, probably something pretty basic that I've already found. Hmm. Kind of weird. I thought the stuff from the data boxes was only stuff you could find in data boxes, not from, like, fragments, but I guess I was wrong. Alright, so what do we got in here? Oh, we already got this one! It, already, it doesn't... <gasps> oh... Man, I thought it was going to show us ones we have not gotten yet. Okay, well, um, I mean, I guess that's the thing. We've already been in here. How did we get in here? Oh, wait a second. I already cut that hole. How did I get in here without cutting that one open? Oh, I probably opened this door. Well, wouldn't the door already be open then? Hmm. Yep. Uh-huh. Probably already did that, and there's a later code. <laughs> oh, fantastic. All right, so it doesn't show you ones you haven't got already. Kind of unfortunate, kind of unfortunate. Okay, so I want to do one more scan because we were looking for uh, quartz earlier. I still need quartz, actually. And I want to... Oh, that's awful. We got to get rid of those beacons. Beacon manager, I don't want to see camera drones right now. <laughs> that's awful. That is awful. We're going to go ahead, and we're going to see... I want to see how much quartz will pop up because I mean it showed two data boxes so if is it going to show each individual piece of quartz I'm pretty sure you can I'm pretty sure you can search for quartz pretty sure you can so it's probably going to show us like a whole like ton of quartz I don't know if there's like a limit a max well let's not go over there get out of here you know what you're done you're done you're done you're done you're done I'm done with you yeah, you're, you're annoying. I hate you. God, I don't like those things. Those things are so obnoxious. <laughs> they are the worst. Okay, so... Stop scanning. I want... Quartz. Make it happen. Okay, we got one. There's way more than one around here. There's way more than one around here. There's one quartz. Oh, there's two. Wait, so how long, how many will it find? I'm curious, I'm gonna sit here for a minute and let it run and see how many we can get. So, I, <laughs> it's, it's finding a lot. <laughs> we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and just keeps, <clears throat> sorry, it just keeps going. So I think we're actually gonna go ahead and build a speed uh, module for this as well. And you can actually, it looks like you can leave this and let it continue scanning. It just keeps going. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have eight now. All right, let's do our speed upgrade, shall we? Nine. We got nine. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, this is funny. 
Is, ten? I don't. Is there a limit? I don't think. I don't think there's a limit to this. That's amazing. So I guess if you want to go out and collect quartz or whatever, I guess you could just let it run for a while. There's eleven. Oh my gosh. Look at the range on this thing. Wow. Do we have a 12? We have a 12! <laughs> look at look at my HUD! Oh, quartz, 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 quartz. Oh, it's everywhere! I love it. This is a good problem to have. There's 13. <laughs> it's insane! There's so much quartz here. It's so funny. I love it. Because that's such a basic thing. And I'm sure you could do the same for titanium. Oh my gosh, it's great. There's 14! It just keeps going. It just keeps going. And I know there's more. There, There's always like clusters of like three or four. There's 15. <laughs> it's so funny. Alrighty, guys. So that's actually going to end this episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe as well. That's 16. And uh, yeah, next episode, I don't know what we'll do. We'll see. We'll see. We might actually build the Cyclops. Uh, we're going to need a course for that. We're going to need... There's 17. <laughs> it has 17 things of course on here. <gasps> it's great. It's great. Alrighty guys. Have a wonderful, wonderful week. I'll see you next time.